Dragonfly, dragonfly, flying high. Dragonfly, dragonfly, up in the sky. Dragonfly, dragonfly, take me with you. Up, up, up in the sky, so blue. So everyone, I'm sure by now you know what this is. It's a dragonfly. So come on, think, put on your caps and tell me what we are going to learn about today. Yes, you're right. We are going to learn about beautiful dragonflies. See, they're so beautiful and colorful. So welcome to the Learning Box by Puntin Kids with a dragonfly session today. Yes, so everyone's going to repeat after me. Which creepy crawly is this? It's a dragonfly. And they're beautiful creepy crawlies. They're so colorful. And you know a lovely fact about the dragonfly? The dragonfly can eat 100 mosquitoes in a day. Can you think of eating 100 rotis in a day? Can we eat 100 rotis in a day? No. But the dragonfly food is mosquitoes and it eats 100 mosquitoes in one day. So what should we say to the dragonfly? Thank you. Say thank you. Because if the dragonfly would not be eating 100 mosquitoes in a day, imagine what would happen to us. The mosquitoes would bite us and we would be feeling itchy and scratching and scratching all day. So the dragonfly keeps the environment clean. And the dragonfly by itself is a very, very clean creepy crawly because it keeps itself totally clean. Yes? And you know one other fact about the dragonfly? The dragonfly is the fastest flying insect. Yeah, it's the fastest flying. Come on, let's see how do we fly fast. Fast, 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 flap your wings, flap your wings, fast, fast. Yes, so the dragonfly is the fastest flying creepy crawly. No other creepy crawly can fly like the dragonfly. And come on everyone, think, think, think. Where do dragonflies come from? How are they born? Do you think a dragonfly removes a small dragonfly from the tummy? No. So what does the dragonfly do? The dragonfly lays eggs on leaves like this. See? It lays eggs on the leaves and from these eggs, who comes out? Small, tiny, baby dragonfly. See, what comes out from these eggs? Once the dragonfly lays the eggs on the leaf, what comes out? Small, cute, little, tiny baby dragonflies so this is how dragonflies are born and now what are we going to do we are also going to learn about the different body parts of the dragonfly so are you all ready with me come on so what do we have here this is the head of the dragonfly what is this head and let me see what's written here what is this this is the thorax of the dragonfly it's the thorax and what is this long one this is the abdomen this is the abdomen of the dragonfly yeah so the dragonfly's body is divided into three parts come on everyone show me all of you head thorax Abdomen. Which are the three parts? Head, thorax, abdomen. And come on, quickly think and tell me. If the dragonfly's body is divided into three parts, what is it? Is it an insect? Is it a bird? Is it an arachnid? What is it? Yes, you are right. It's an insect. Because the body is divided into three parts. Head, thorax, abdomen. And also, 
the legs and the wings are on the thorax that means it's an insect and let's count how many wings does it have come on one two three four so just like all insects have to have four wings it has four wings and how many legs come on one two three four five six there you go it has six legs four wings the body is divided into three parts that's head thorax and abdomen so obviously it's an insect and also it has tiny antennae which makes it an insect okay and do you know something amazing about the dragonfly the dragonfly has big compound eyes they're called compound eyes and they're very big on the entire head most of the part is covered with eyes yeah and these eyes can see everywhere so the dragonfly can see what is in the front what is on the left what is on the right and even what is behind can you see what's behind you can you without looking behind tell me what's behind you no when we have to look behind what do we have to do we have to turn around but the dragonfly doesn't have to turn around because the eyes are so big it can see all around and the best part is that the dragonfly can fly up can fly down can fly left can fly right can fly straight in the front but the funny one is it can fly backward also yes it can fly backward also other insects have to take a turn and fly but what can the dragon fly do it doesn't have to take a turn it just flies backward isn't it an amazing insect yes so are you happy learning about the dragon fly i'm sure you are because i love it so much so please do share like and subscribe see you soon bye